welcome back ladies and gentlemen it's benedict here again so let's see how now we can uh, uh, group uh, data within data frame so by grouping we'll be grouping based on uh, columns column labels and uh, the values within the data frame so let's see how we can group by and also we'll, we'll see how we can uh, I uh, know the first row of each group out number of data frame groups and then get a specific group uh, get specific group by group name so let me just take you to our uh, python code so here already we have, we have a data frame and uh, we have a combined data frame so i want us to use the combined data frame so let me try to Comment these other data frames out. I will comment this. I will comment other. Comment this one out. Just I will comment this one out. This well. I want us to only, only use uh, the combined data frame. So let me run this code. So I want us to use uh, the combined data frame. Let me just pull this one up. So here, what I want us to do, we want to group by. We want to group by so we have combined data frame and we want to group by uh, uh, column uh, labels so we can group by uh, by name but we can't group by name because uh, we only have individual names and then we can also we can group by country uh, we can group by marital status so let's start by grouping by country so just right here grouping by grouping data frame so we want to group by country so let's see we want to say combined uh, it's not combined new but combined combined Combine DF uh, Combine DF is equal to is equal to combine DF will combine DF dot group by back I do want to group by country right here country and here we'll write dot sum we are writing dot sum to sum uh, the numerical uh, columns so now when I come down here in the print combined Yes. Let me call it a group combined. Grouped. Grouped data. Then escape character. And let's see what we have. So now you can see we grouped by a uh, country. So after grouping by country, we will not have uh, uh, the names. Names will go. And, uh, and again, the, 
the raw index also has, has, has gone so we have uh, grouping by age or by country and then now we have age by income and children now you can see we have how many rows we have one two three four five rows so we have five rows after uh, grouping by uh, by country and again you can also group by you can group by marital status so here we'll uh, change this one to marital status marital status If I group by methods, but as you can see, we have divorced, married, and sick. And then we have uh, this columns for age, income, and children. Okay. So we've grouped by medical status, but now we don't have uh, uh, the countries where they come from. So these are the text values will have uh, disappeared when we are grouping by unless uh, we also add the columns but when we group by the only take uh, uh, that column for group by uh, and then these other columns will remain uh, uh, numerical columns because we are summing the, the values of those uh, numerical columns so again we were saying that we can also know the uh, uh, the first row of each group so to know the first row of each group you can come down here and say uh, first row of each group. let me just call this one first row of each group uh, first underscore row equal to So here will come and let me just copy this. Okay. Paste this one down here. So we are grouping by marital status. Again, inside here we are saying we are calling the the first we are calling the first uh, whatever the first uh, uh, group so here it will be it should be this or this bracket should not be here it should be somewhere here so here should be dot But first, so I can print first, first row. Let me create a space also. Print So in this case, the first row of each group is same. Okay. We wanted to see the first row of each group. It will all remain the same because we only have uh, uh, three groups. Then we can also know the size of each group. So here again, we'll just copy. Let me copy this. And put it down here. So here instead of writing a first the right size, so first row. Let me just call this one size group underscore size. So here we print group size.
then let's run the code so you can see here we have uh, the multiple suitors and then the group size divorce is one married is one single is one so uh, the size of each and every group is one uh, that's how to you know the group size uh, now let's see how we can get a specific group uh, by group name so we'll come down here and say uh, uh, let's say we have uh, uh, let's talk about my code status so we'll talk about marriage So we'll come here and say married is equal to uh, combined dot group by bind bracket. So here we'll write married. Then this side we'll write dot get. underscore group then in bracket here you want to say married and down here will say print right and just create a space between the data frames and So let's see if we can get uh, this group for married by calling the group name. So there's an error, 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 error. Yeah, this should be group by put group. And let me call it again. Married, married, married. So this should be not married but married 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 old status marital underscore status then this other side is married so now you can see married we have um, uh we have uh, they have total the age, uh, we have to 32 years, and the total income was uh, 22, uh, the 228,000, uh, and then the number of children are 24. So what about, uh, let me try as well, income. Then here we'll write income the income what can we pick income income let's say 25,000 those who are running 25,000 so here we'll say income and down there we'll say income And let's run the code. So 25,000 should be your number, not uh, not a string. Error 25,000. you are just right income Royce keep error name 
so group set group so let me just check what is here uh -huh. It is an error. Let's try again if we can group by. Uh, hmm. Let me see marital status again. Marital underscore status. Then here I want to pick single. I want to pick single so this one I'll say uh, let me just say status status so single we have age 141 and uh, income is and twenty two thousand. So let me see what is there in single. We have one, two, three, four, five. Let's see the number of children before we are sure of what we are doing. The number of children for single eight. What do we have here for single? We have one. Uh, that's seven that's eight so that's okay so i think that the principle is the same so you just uh, write this code in this manner so here we have the um uh, the column label my code status and then get the group uh, by so we get the group by name so we are we are calling uh, those who are single in this data frame so we have them uh, we have four people we have four of them one two three now uh, we have five of them so we'll get the total number of children the total number of income and the total number of ages so that's what has happened down here so that's how you call uh, the say get uh, get a group Get a group by group name. Oh, my data frame. So that was how to get a group by group name from a data grams or other data frame. So we are calling the group name here a single. But first, we are grouping by my third setters. Then, within that that group uh, of of uh, within the groups, uh, we are calling the the group name uh, for those who are single. And that's how it's been, it's done. So, I uh, will call it a day for this video. Uh, for group by. So when we come back, I will show you how we can I uh, can set a column as a row index uh, within a data, a data frame so thanks a lot for watching and let's meet again in the next video